guys, so I'm here with another Try the World box. I'm so excited about this box because I took a quick peek into the box and it's from my mom's home country, which is Thailand. I'm so excited. I didn't really look and see what it was. However, I wanted to, but I wanted to do a fresh unboxing and maybe I'll go ahead and enter some clips of me using the products and things like that. All right, so here on the inside of the box, they have the card right here and it says the Thailand box. This is the culture guide. So I'm so excited because hopefully I'll be familiar with everything. I know I don't like everything from there, but let's see what goes on here. So here is the country here. Um, let's see, the chef is Jet Tila. Okay, I, I don't wanna look at everything here just yet because I don't wanna look at the recipes or the ingredients yet. I wanna be kind of surprised by it. So here's the box and it's always, always jam full of stuff. So, and this box is no different. So, oh, I'm so excited. I see something here that I'm a little bit afraid of and I'm gonna be honest with you, but let's go on. All right, first thing is some green curry paste. Um, in my household, we cook curry quite often. So the green curry is not actually our favorite curry out of all of them. We prefer like um, the red curry or the Penang curry, those types of curries. But um, I'll definitely go ahead and cook this up for my family that they really love it. Um, I have never tried this particular brand of curry. So um, normally how it is, you get you just buy the curry paste and you add all the ingredients. And I imagine that this will be um, very similar to that. All right, next is coconut flour syrup. I'm not familiar with this, so I'm not exactly sure what I have to do with this. Um, coconut flour syrup. Um, I have to read in the card to see exactly what I'm supposed to do with that. I had all of my family here yesterday, and I wish I would have pulled out the box to talk to them about it to see what I'm supposed to do with everything. Wow. Let me just dip my little pinky in here to get the drippings that are coming off the lid. Oh, that's good. That's almost like, it's different. It's almost like caramel, but not. It's an interesting flavor. It's very good though. Very good. All right, next. I'm gonna pull out the thing that I'm not so excited about. Um, th but this is dried. So it's soft dried jasmine fruit um fruit jackfruit fruit dried fruit <laughs> so you can kind of see like the little bits in there and everything um my brother actually has a tree of this in his backyard and they grow to like these massive sizes and um they they eat it all the time um but the dried fruit i've never tried it so, so we'll we'll go ahead and give it a go and try it out i am not familiar with this either this is jazzberry rice organic and non-gmo natural source antioxidants um this says it's from 100 percent small scale farmers this is a 8.8 .8 ounce block of rice it just says here to rinse it off to get rid of the purple color and then you cook it up regular um, like in a rice cooker or you can do it in the pan however you you cook your rice um, and use it as a side so that's so cool I have stuff in here that I have no idea uh, what is this this is taro chips 100% natural natural vegetables sorry I was too busy trying to open the box so it comes in a box like this this is cool huh taro I think it's like potatoes I want to say so let's see. Yeah, almost like maybe like malanga, like malanga chips or something. Oh. oh, they're a little bit sweet. They're not salty or savory at all. It has taro, sugar, palm oil, and salt. Hmm, this is so yummy. This reminds me of a, like a dessert that when we would go to little festivals that they have and they deep fry them there this is similar like a it's similar like a potato like a root vegetable um but it says that it is more it's richer richer and milky in flavor which yeah that's true 
but um, they used to take like some kind of like banana chips or something like that and they would coat them and they would fry them and it would be like a, a sweet dessert kind of thing. And this tastes very similar to that. Mm. Really good. Interesting, interesting, and I really like that. Mm. Okay, always care for you. This is from Lum Lum Organic Tom Yum Soup Set. Awesome. Oh my gosh, my son is going to love this. He loves Tom Yum Soup. Um, this has all the dried... Oh my gosh, I'm going to have to open this up for you so you can see all the little pieces in here. But it's got everything in here. Um, how do you cook this? Let's see. It has the lemon leaves. It's got... Um, lemongrass, it has the mushrooms and the peppers, everything inside here to go with it. So this is um, tom yum soup is like a, a lemony, sour, spicy soup and it's delicious. You can have it. They have tom yum gai which is chicken, tom yum goon which is shrimp. Um, so you can have it any kind of way. Usually we have it with shrimp which is the goon, tom yum goon. Um, it's really yummy. You can see right here like this is what it's gonna look like. Uh, hopefully, we'll see. I don't know if there's other ingredients that you have to add to it to make the soup, because um, it kind of looks like there's something missing in here, like the base of the soup. But maybe these are the ingredients. I have, I actually have the soup base to make it, so I don't know if I have to do all that, but we'll see. And hopefully I'll be able to put in some clips of the soup that I'm gonna go ahead and make. Um, so that is my intent of it. So hopefully you guys are watching that and seeing it. Um, this here is virgin cocoa coconut crisp rolls. Um, interesting. I know coconut is like a big thing, everything. They love coconut, coconut, everything. So I'm going to open this up and try this out as well. Ah, I can already see it comes with a whole bunch of rolls. I like that it's all airtight. Nice and snug and then it's not gonna break so i'm gonna rip this open right now and try it out oh, i wish my cousins were here with me so that they could try this out um so it's these little tiny crisps oh, it smells so good it smells like roasted coconut mm -hmm. oh my god it's so good Mm. This is so freaking good. How do they make this? I don't even know. However they make it, it's delicious. It's like roasted coconut. Oh my gosh, you guys. Where can I buy this? Hello. It looks like this. Yummy. Oh my gosh. Huh. Mmm. Mm, it's so freaking good. Authentic Thai iced tea. Okay, you people. You guys don't know about Thai tea or Thai coffee. This is great. My mom used to make it. We used to have a restaurant back in the day when my mom was alive. She's not alive anymore. But people love Thai tea. They love to have Thai tea, Thai coffee. Um, so when she would make it in these huge vats of tea and coffee and just we'd go through it like crazy in the restaurant. But, oh. Uh, amazing Thai tea everybody loves it so what an amazing box I can say um, some of the stuff is brand new to me that I don't know anything about it so that is pretty cool because um, you always want to get something that you're not familiar with I can't even put everything in the box because there's so many things in this box this was jam-packed full of goodies so excited so here is some of the items right here and the other items, let me just hold them up. Here are the other two items here. Can't hold it. Okay. And here are the other two. So we have the tom yum soup. We have this dried jackfruit. And over here on this side, we have this rice that I'm not familiar. It says jazzberry rice. You know, jasmine rice is a common rice for Thai people. And then this is the coconut flour syrup. The green curry, the taro chips, and these coconut crisps, which were to die for. And don't forget the Thai tea in the back. So amazing box. Oh my gosh, you guys. Try the world. I'm always thoroughly impressed with the box. I am so excited to get to cooking and all 
I'm just so excited. I'm gonna go see my cousin now and I'm gonna bring those coconut crisps with me <laughs> so that she can try them out. And maybe I'll bring this box with me so she can kind of tell me a little bit more about it because although my mom is Thai, my father is not. Um, so I'm a mix, um, but all my cousins, they're all here from Thailand. So they're 100% obviously. Um, so they could probably tell me a little bit more about all these different items and how they would use them in daily cooking and snacks and things like that. So I'm super excited. If you want to know more about Try the World, everything will be down in the description box down below. Go ahead and check them out. Um, they have, I, I love that it's a box that is from one particular country and it just features all the items in that particular country that um, the chef of the month or the curator of the box of the month chooses. So it's quite interesting. Um, you never know what box you're gonna get um, for that month. It comes out every two months and every two months I'm super excited to see what it is. You people, I'm so happy with this month's box. So anyway, that is it. Thank you guys so very much for watching. Like and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Um, leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you've ever tried any of these things, if you have any tips or tricks with any of these items. And I will see you again in another video. Bye.